by the mood of the house, uh, 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 every member is supporting this issue. Former members of parliament who served between 1984 and 2001 might soon be pocketing at least 100,000 every month if President Uhuru Kenyatta will assent to the amendments made to the Parliamentary Pensions Act. There is a saying in uh, Ijaluo that you only escape from the rain with a light basket. This means the taxpayer will cough 450 million shillings annually as pension for former members of parliament. Members of parliament in the current house have defended the former lawmakers, whom they say some are living in dire conditions. These are people who are in dire need of assistance, Mr. Speaker. Some of them are of old age, Mr. Speaker. They are above 70, 80 years, Mr. Speaker. And some of them, one, of, one or two, I attended their burial, Mr. Speaker. They were really, really in, in dire need of help, Mr. Speaker, and they were buried as destitutes, Mr. Speaker. Majority leader Amos Kimunya is proposing more Kenyans who served the nation to be paid as well. And this is something we need to look at, not just for members of parliament, but even from the sports people, from all those people that we see suffering after bringing honors and glory to this country, but we abandon them at their hour of need. There is a township member of parliament, Eden Duale, has expressed fear as this will open doors for the other sectors in the civil service to demand more as pension funds. Uh, taking into account the situation of the economy now, this bill will cause serious strain to the exchequer. But more worse, I mean, more worse than that, and I think we must lift the fact that this is going to incite all the other sectors within the civil service. If the bill will be signed into law, 375 members of parliament will receive an increment of the pension fund. Andrew Kilemi for TV 47.